Welcome back. Rich Abney joins us now with sports, and it was a really busy weekend, also a memorable one for the Cougars. It was, yeah. Thank you, Aileen. Now, Saturday saw the last game of the 2013-2014 season for the Cougars. Now, even with no chance of making the playoffs, the Cougars would make it an exciting night for their fans at the CN Center. The Prince George Cougars' last game of the season was Saturday night against the Kamloops Blazers. With the Cats out of the playoffs, there was two things left to fight for. First was getting Troy Burke the Cats' all-time points lead. It would only take Burke four minutes to tie Eric Hunter at 233 points when his backhand goes off Edson Harlacker's skate and squeezes by Bolton Pouliot, one nothing Cougars. Five minutes later, it's Blazers captain Matt Needham to even it at one. With seven minutes left in the first, Burke gives a short pass to Peter Kosterman, who sends it off the boards to clear the zone, and Brad Morrison takes over from there as he puts Burke at 234 points for the record. The second period, all efforts were now on Todd Fiddler as he sat with 46 goals on the season until Burke's tap pass sends Fiddler on a break and he makes it 47. Jesse Shinkaruk makes it 3 2 Cougars, and Fiddler's cannon makes it 4 2 after two. Less than a minute into the third, Blazers strike back when Devin Sidoroff taps one past Edmonds, 4-3 Cougars. And Clark Wilson does this one all by himself, 5-3 Cougars. Just over a minute later, Cat shorthanded, but Fiddler does not care. He wants 50 bad, and he beats Harlacher to the left post and Pouliot to the right to put his tally at 49. And with just four minutes left in his WHL career and almost nothing left in the tank, Todd Fiddler makes a mad jab deep in Pouliot's crease and becomes only the second Prince George Cougar to reach 50 goals. The Cats would get one more for an A3 final and one memorable night in the CN Center. The backup goalie sits beside me in the dressing room and actually just kept telling me two goals a period, it's two goals a period uh, after the first there and first two went in and I started just believing in because yesterday Honestly, had about 15 shots personally, and nothing was going in. Coach was really wanted me to get it, and he's giving me extra ice time thanks to him. And obviously, I was, I was so tired, and I'm just so glad and so thankful that I got 50. It was nice, you know, get that record and, and kind of get it out of the way. And uh, my main focus for for the last 40 minutes was helping our 20s out. And uh, for Fids, you know, it's it was four goals, and he had two pairs to do it. So it just shows, you know, the, the skill level, the talent level he has, and. Uh, I'm glad he got it. Uh, it means a lot even to all the boys that he, that he got it. Derek Braid, CKPG Sports.